so <laughs> the upcoming 7th anniversary Dual Dokkan Fest DLRs have kind of been leaked. And of course, there's been speculation about it for many, many weeks now, with some people saying it's going to be Gogeta and Vegito, or two Gogetas, or two Vegitos, or something else. But those were just predictions, right? We didn't really have any solid evidence or any confirmation until right now. And essentially, what happened was, about an hour ago, this guy on Twitter named Dokkan Reborn pointed out the fact that some of the tags that Bandai used for their upcoming 7th anniversary livestream, which is starting in about 2 days from now, contain a few spoilers for the contents of the stream. Specifically, the tags that said Goku, Vegeta, and most importantly, Gogeta. And based off this, we can assume that they are definitely going to be talking about Gogeta during the stream, and he's probably going to be a pretty big part of the celebration. So yeah, they definitely messed up there, should not have included Gogeta in the tags, but if that was it, you know, if there was nothing else, then I probably wouldn't make a video about this, because it's not a huge deal. I think most of us assumed that there was going to be at least one LR Gogeta for the upcoming Dual Dokkan Fest, so... Yeah, like even though it was a spoiler, it's nothing too crazy, right? But what happened next was Kawhi decided to respond to this tweet, and he said, hold on, let me just uh, quickly translate this. Okay, so he says, close your eyes, those who don't want spoilers. They really don't make an effort since the information will drop shortly. Know that this has been in the global version database for weeks and weeks. So this is the Japanese, which uh, I think most of us can't read, but he did also translate it into English. And <laughs> as you can see, within the global database for apparently over a month now, is information about a <laughs> LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta that have Ryuken or Dragon Fist and Final Shine Attack as their super attack. There's also information about a Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta with a counter mechanic. And there's also info about an LR Super Saiyan God, Goku, and Super Saiyan God, Vegeta. So, yeah. There you go, guys. Uh, it seems like, based on the information within the database that we are going to be getting LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta with a Dragon Fist and Final Shine Attack uh, Super Attack that fuse into Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and then the other unit is going to be LR Super Saiyan God Goku and Super Saiyan God Vegeta that we can assume fuse into Super Saiyan God or sorry uh, fuse into Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta and it's just kind of crazy to me, man. This is it. <laughs> it's kind of crazy to me that they just had this in the database when they knew, they knew that people could access it at any time. At least the data miners can, right? Like maybe we don't know how to, but these guys know, and they found it, and here it is. Um, but I mean, I guess like based on the track history of this game and based on the track history of Bandai themselves. Uh, they don't really care about this stuff. Like, they don't care about leaks, they don't care about information getting out early, because just look at how many times we've received data downloads for new units before they reveal them in, like, the Dokkan Now programs or in the streams. So I guess it's not really that much of a surprise, but I'm still surprised, nonetheless, I gotta say. Um, it looks like a double... Gogeta celebration and I mean hold on I guess I guess the LR Super Saiyan God Goku oh never mind it's Super Saiyan God Goku and Super Saiyan God Vegeta okay that's gonna be Gogeta yeah so double Gogeta my bad my bad at first for a second I was like maybe that one's gonna be a Vegito but no that doesn't make any sense so double Gogeta guys Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta, I'm sorry to all the Vegito fanboys out there, 
I feel you guys. I would have preferred to at least get some Bajito love as well. Uh, maybe for part two. <sighs> Who knows? I mean, anything is possible. Maybe for part two, we'll get a double Vegito celebration. Maybe it's going to be like back to back dual Dokkan Fest, which would be different. It would be insane. But crazier things have happened. Now, just to be clear, <laughs> before anybody comments this or asks about this, uh, just because this was in the global database does not mean that it's going to be coming to global at the same time. It does not mean that we're just going to get the 7th anniversary at the same time as JP because that wouldn't make any sense. Um, it's just in there. Sometimes they just like add stuff into global early, but it doesn't necessarily mean that's going to be coming out anytime soon. So uh, yeah, global still going to be getting our anniversary at the regular time in July uh, for JP obviously in a couple days it's gonna be starting and once it starts there's gonna be two banners one for Super Saiyan 4s uh, Goku and Vegeta slash Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and uh, another one for Super Saiyan God Goku and Super Saiyan God Vegeta that become Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta I mean we've been talking about this for so long um, so it's not like I'm shocked by any of this stuff, but for it to be kind of like confirmed by Kawhi at this point is Still a little bit surreal. I gotta say it still feels kind of weird to Just have it like in my face like this now obviously there's still gonna be You know some surprise when it comes to the animations when it comes to the uh, Kit right like what they do their leader skills their passives their active skills their possibly new mechanics, right? Like usually for anniversaries, we tend to get some kind of new mechanic, right? Or is that for download celebrations? Hold on. Wait, is it download celebrations we get new mechanics or is it anniversaries we get new mechanics? I think it's anniversaries, yeah, because we got the um, re rebirth skills. I'm so messed up right now, I can't even remember what it's called. Uh, revival skills, <laughs> revival skills, not rebirth, revival skills last year. So yeah, we should be getting some kind of new mechanic this year as well, I believe, but maybe not. Either way, um, it's still going to be hyped to see all that stuff, right? It's still going to be hyped to actually see what they look like, but, but now we know what the units are actually going to be. We know what the characters are, and uh... It's still weird to me that it's double Gogeta, man. It's still very, very strange that there's no Vegito love for at least the first part of the anniversary, it seems like. But as the biggest Gogeta fanboy in the world, <laughs> I'm pretty happy about it. I, I really am. I really am. I can't complain about this. Uh, hopefully Vegito does eventually get some love later in the celebration. But it looks like this year is just Gogeta's year, man. It looks like it's just Gogeta's celebration. So let me know what you guys feel about that or how you guys feel about that in the comments. Um, this is insane. This is absolutely wild. And uh, shout out to Kawai for providing us with this information. Shout out to Dokkan Reborn as well for pointing out the, the tags in the uh, anniversary stream. And uh, yeah. That's going to do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, give me all of your opinions, all of your thoughts in the comments down below. And when any more information comes out about this uh, celebration, about this anniversary, I'll make sure to fill you guys in in another video. But uh, yeah, as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel. If you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.